Bosco with the uh, firm of Blatcher, Tunia, you know, member of CPAs. Hi, uh, Simon Costello with the Los Angeles LGBT Center. Uh, Stephen Barrow from West Coast Photo. Ray Howard with Occidental Entertainment. Okay, I'll say here I'm probably with them for years. And that's a great thing. Brian Shade with Alan. Brian Burke from McCann State Studio. I'm Alan from the Main Mayor Incorporated. Mike Langford from the Main Mode 47 from the Musician Community. Thor Lee with David C. Young from Richard Rock with Professor Wilson. David Bass, producer of Film Center. Jim O'Mahan, operations manager with Lord of Gibbs. Lisa Schechter, executive director for the Men. Lori Goldman, representing the Red Restaurant in the President. Okay. Um, Adrian, since you're the only non board member here, do you have any public comment? Thank you. Okay, have the miniature in your packet. If you could please take a quick look. If you find you know, nothing in error, I will entertain a motion to accept. Expense. As a matter of fact, in 2000, again, it's 2015, 
uh, uh, city contribution, and it was received in, uh, I think it's uh, late January, so it has already been received. So you have total assets of 256,000 uh, liabilities. We had the account spayable, as you know, as, as of December 31st, 2015, you uh, had $78,000 in expenses uh, payable. So th those are mainly invoices you know, for the two major vendors uh, for uh, uh, cleaning and security. So these are uh, invoices uh, mostly for the month of December that were paid early in January. Okay, so those were uh, uh, very quickly paid in January. In January. Uh, then we come into the unrestricted assets. So this is like your equity, your equity accounts. Uh, you know, we have, uh, is, is, you know, the, the regulations require that you disclose how much money you have available from prior bids. So the first amount, uh, $74,000, is what was left from bid three, no, bid, bid one, bid one. And we have a note that explains uh, the uh, board designation. So you have $74,000 from bid one, $42,000 amounts left over from bid two, and then of course 61,000 is the remaining for this for this year. So for the first year of bid. Of That's the rollover amounts. That's the rollover amounts. 61,000. Exactly. More than Any questions on this particular page? Okay, going to page, uh, page four, next page. Uh, this is your total loss. Uh, we have the uh, revenues, we have uh, uh, this, uh, business improvement district assessments received, 1031000 general benefits and contribution, 32000 refunds, uh, $7,200. These were refunds uh, from UPS. Um, mm -hmm. I, I think that there was a, there was a, a billing errors, a billing errors and uh, they, they refunded you back uh, $7,300. Interest, uh, $691. And in kind donations, in kind donations are uh, the, uh, the fair market value of the, uh, uh, the, the donated space you know, for administration. So and that's also, it was returning that the permits from CD4 mm -hmm. donated. Mm -hmm. What is the in kind value of an asset and an expense that's identical? Right. And, you know, in, in general, except that principles, uh, when this happens, uh, yes, so then, uh, you, know, it, we, you know, it is okay for us to book the revenue and the expense. You know, so just to uh, let... Uh, what is it? What is it? It's, 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 it's an in-kind donation. Uh, what is, what is it? What is it? Our office space at Hollywood Center Studios okay. is donated to us, okay. and yours too, okay. from the security okay. office. Yeah, yeah. both. Okay. Right. So, yeah, so it is, it is uh, recognized both as a revenue and as an expense, so you have zero effect. But it recognizes that the need is there and it was met. Uh, so you have revenues for the year about $1.1 million. Now, on the expenses, you have cleaning and maintenance, $248,000. Improvements of market, uh, our market, you know, $27. Security, $562,000. Management, $189,000. The income donations of $20,000. Uh, Third expenses at one million twenty-three. So for the year, you had more rather than expenses. So you have sixty-eight thousand uh, dollars moving forward into next year. Uh, we add that to your beginning net assets. So uh, the end net assets at the end of the year is hundred seventy thousand. Any questions on this page? Uh, next page is uh, some of the cash flow. Some of the cash flows is uh, like a bank reconciliation. We, we begin with what is my per per profit for loss for the year. So in this case, you have a profit or excess revenues of sixty-eight thousand dollars, and then we take a look at uh, how quickly you collected your receivables or paid your payables, because that has, that has uh, a direct effect on your on your working capital. So we have a, an increase in uh, receivables of thirty-two thousand. So, you know, it is negative because if the receivables goes up, it means that uh, you did not bring the cash. So that's why it's negative. Uh, and then you have accounts payable, 42,000. That means that uh, when you compare uh, accounts payable from the beginning of the year to the end of the year, it, uh, it, uh, it decreased by 42,000. So it's also a use of cash. So for the year, you had a net use of cash of $6,300. And we compare that to your beginning cash. So then we can work on something during the cash. Any questions on this page? 
If you look into page six, and this, these are, these are standard uh, criminal disclosures that are required on the Junior Exhibit Accounting Principles. Uh, the only thing that can be added is in the third paragraph on note one that uh, you know, it, could, it indicates uh, that you are required to file a review with the city clerk. So that is a, a new paragraph this year. Uh, any questions on the page? Again, these are, these are uh, standard disclosures uh, that you see in any, any financial statements. Page seven, uh, again, there's no, no updates, uh, no changes, so it's pretty much same, same as last year. Uh, page eight, uh, we do have a new note, uh, that is uh, note number four, so in the middle of page eight. And that kind of describes what uh, the uh, board designation is in regards to the uh, bid one rule floor money, the $74,000. That has to do with, remember back in 2004, there was an MTA grant. Uh, it's called the MTA Way Finding Grant. After a lot of research that Lisa has done, she concluded that, you know, uh, in, in accordance with the plan, uh, plan use of those sources, uh, it, would be, it would be appropriate to earmark the $74,000 for these three purposes. So the $74,000 from bid one are gonna be spent uh, $40,000 on the medallions, uh, $18,000 on about 15 new uh, trash receptacles, and about $16,000 on the banner program. Okay, so that's gonna be you know, the, the board designation of, of the use of those funds. Any questions? Thank you. Uh, and then page nine is uh, uh, that uh, the yeah, management has reviewed the statements and that the changes are necessary. Any questions on the report? Chairs of that committee. It, that committee meets 
on the first Thursday at 3 p.m. And at their next meeting, they're having a presentation on the initiative, the Neighborhood Integrity Initiative. We also have um, two ad hoc committees. One is the bylaws committee that's chaired by Will. Um, our bylaws are in desperate need of some attention. And serving on that committee with Will is Carol Casella, David Bass, Ron Broker, and myself. We have a website committee that is chaired by JL. And I know Joseph Barrett wanted to be on that committee. If there is someone else who would like to be on our website committee, it's an ad hoc committee, it's just till we get its architecture done and get it working, please contact JL. Um, on our finance committee, Jeff is chair of the finance committee with um, JL, and we need another member on our finance committee. Any volunteers? Don't all raise your hand at once. You know, when you pick something. <laughs> That's what, right. When they're not here, they get on a committee. Um, they get picked. Um, okay, we still have to fill that seat. Uh, the nominating committee David Bass is the chair, Michael Enby, Mike Malik, Jock Musachi, and Will Annabelle. And then Mr. Broker has volunteered to be the chair of our business watch committee with a little arm twisting by me. Can I just throw in quickly with all of these committees and everybody, uh, and we, you know, having you chair committee, uh, quorum is very important. Please. This is why we were trying to keep our committees at five for the better quorum is three. Yeah. 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 So we will, um, Lisa will circulate a list of all our committees with members and when they are meeting so that you all have that. And we should be able to start rocking and rolling real soon. Carol um, suggested we look at having a retreat this summer. And so we're looking at having retreats. That's my executive committee report. You're next. Oh. All right. Uh, question, question. Yes, sir. Did you mention safety? I did. I'm sorry. Carol's the chair. Um, you're on. You're on it. JL is on it, Thor is on it. So you're now on both of them? What? Lori, you are being, do you want to make sure that there are some people who are going to be more than the cases? Anybody else? Uh, we could use, oh, you told me you really yeah. wanted, never mind. What did you add? Oh, Vaughn, you wanted it. You're on the safe committee. Okay, so the members of the safe committee are Carol's chairing it, Simon, JL, Thor, and Ron. Safe committee. And Carol's chairing. She's sorry she couldn't be here. She's still sick with her bronchitis. I apologize. You're next. The executive committee for the month of January, we, Jim and myself, um, have been busy reorganizing. Um, updating our financials to QuickBooks and QuickBooks Online, and closing out our 2015, which we just received the report on, and uploading all the information for the 2016 report, um, as well as being busy organizing new committees and a new committee structure that hopefully will be very effective for all of our members. Um, so we really need to hone in on specific items that you guys want to see the bid uh, accomplished over this next uh, eight months or 10 months of our of 2016. In the interim, um, Jim and I, uh, we still have our bylaws out to be looked at in our other documents, so we want to work on that for our books. Um, and Jim and I also uh, worked on yet producing some vinyl security stickers, uh, collateral that our security guards are driving around can hand out. They're actually just vinyl, they're light stickers, but they're stickers so you can fill on and come off with security number because that's the most important number that everybody wants to call and that's the basic bit. So those should be released um, probably within the next week and we're also going to include a sticker in our newsletter that's coming out this quarter. Um, I've been actively working on the medians, trying to get some grant monies for the six medians on Thailand with our, our community committee and so I've actively been pursuing DWP and any type of rebates 
for uh, incentives that they're offering. I'm also meeting with Youth Policy Institute and uh, the Promise Center to see if they have any grant monies available. Um, I think that that would be a good way for your bus to clean up all that, all those meetings in there and get some nice California draft power plants, redo the sprinklers, and create an impact on Highland Avenue. Um, I am asking the board today if I can be authorized to buy 15 trash cans um, through New Jersey Audit, Keystone Ridge. Oh, okay. Because we gave it to you through the So report. if I buy them through Keystone this month, it's free shipping, which equates to roughly uh, 25, 25 to $3,000 in savings. Um, I think we did just look at replacing trash cans on an annual basis. Um, these trash cans are going to go on the perimeter of our bid and to the areas where we where the bid was expanded, so Sprouts is now open, so trash cans can be over in that area. Pavilion doesn't have any trash cans as well, and I think it will uh, uh, show a border where our bid is located if you saw it. So that's kind of what I'm working on, and I look forward to working on all these committees that we're juggling right now. <laughs> and just so you know, because it was item four, so we approved it. Oh, okay. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you, Lisa. Um, Mr. Bass, nominating committee report? We had our first meeting this afternoon at 2.30, and we discussed a few things. First of all, we discussed the, um, the vacancy, filling the vacancy of Jennifer Wilson. And we also came to the conclusion that generally, two things. One, that we should attract some candidates for future vacancies that should occur, and for future elections, and so that we have a good cross-section of the community uh, bid. And the other point that we need to focus on is that we feel obligated to consider other um, other nominees for the vacancy uh, rather than simply the one designated by the legislative the candidate. You know, maybe the one that they designated may be great, but I think we're obligated to just go through that process and come up with some more candidates, which we will, and in the, in the near term, we'll be meeting probably monthly. I think you've already got the, the next one set, so we can keep this process going. Thank you very much. Okay. Question. Yes, sir. Um, does somebody have to be on the board? To... No. To do what? To be on, to be on the, the committee. committee. Because some of the things when you're looking for future board members, Goodness throw them on a committee, you can kind of get the labor of that. Yeah. And, 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 yeah. Really good well, suggestion.
15 new trash cans. Um, uh, security cameras is going to uh, uh, safety committee. Uh, cleaning and greening issues. Um, in case you want, this, we're not going to elaborate on it, but you know, if you want to know what that means, it's tree trimming, landscaping, mediums that she uh, just mentioned. And then uh, an RFP is being prepared by staff uh, concerning that particular thing. That's all I have right now. Until Thank we meet the next time. Thank you very much. You want to show the shirt that the That's right. And that would be. Yeah, we have, you'll recall when we ordered new shirts, we didn't like our prison. The beautification team. Really good. Really good. And it has our logo. Isn't that nice? Uh, we're deferring uh, the safe committee for Carol's request. She's not here today. Um, we'll, I have to the bylaws, but since we have I will defer that till next meeting. Do you have anything to say on the website committee, sir? Well, we haven't had a meeting yet, but uh, I have some raw data that will give a little bit of context for our first meeting. What uh, other bids might have gone through their process? We've been confused, they've been out there. Their jobs, uh, some pricing information. So once we get together, hopefully in the next few weeks. You think you'll be able to make a report at the March meeting? Possibly. That would be. <laughs> that was an art whistle. <laughs> um, okay, any old business on the table to discuss? Any new business? Um, Lisa passed this on to me. Um, tonight there is an open house at the Hollywood, Carrie's Hollywood Bid at their new office. So if anyone wants to be here and go, here's the invitation. We'll show it to you. It's at 5 30 to 7 30. I have one new business. Okay, sure. Um, wanted to revisit the start time of the meeting. I know we talked about we used to for a short time at 4 o'clock and we just wanted to see. That would work for your president, but it oh. might work for everybody uh, else. Uh, <laughs> now make it work. Is it good? Well, that's right. Like, oh, we changed the start time. Five, it's just, we did that for like five yeah. minutes. We well, no, five, five minutes. <laughs> um, I'm happy to entertain you. The problem is that we didn't spend right about five. Oh, no, that's not true. You need the room. Yeah, and I'm planning to get the room very fast. Yeah, and it's tough. Keep it 30, 3 30 is fine. You can tell me. Today it looks like we're going to do it today. We're always going to be that way, guys. We're doing things today. Right, we might. Can we mention that too? We might. We might be able to. I thought it was close to it. I mean, I think Mike was pointing fair. Everybody from here is going to be on. And it's going to be on. It's going to be on. It's going to be on. Okay, we will consider that, Mr. Mallet. Any other new business? If not, I'll entertain a motion to adjourn the meeting. Oh, I make that motion. At four, oh, at